Hi, I'm Dale the Insanikin. How's it going? Let me know in the comments and hit the like button before we get started here. Playing more Super Mario Maker 2 today. We're gonna do something a little bit different. We're gonna try out levels with the shooter tag. I don't know what to expect from this. It's gonna be a little bit different. Um, I expect that tag might mean something different for each individual level that has the tag on it. Um, yeah. We're gonna see what happens here. Like I said, I, I genuinely don't know what to expect. All right. So this... I mean, I can kind of see how this would fit the, uh, the shooter tag right here. You're trying to aim... Time something, you know, you're trying to throw a projectile at a thing. It's, it, it makes sense. There we go. Alright. Let's see what we gotta do here. Need to land that. Perfect. Alright. See? As was that one. So far, only one of them really gave me an issue. That seems to be continuing to be the case. Uh, no. Well, at least we got 30 coin. What we want to do here is wait until it's at the bottom. I mean, like, maybe at the very bottom. I need to wait for it to come back down, and then too early. Or too late, rather. Maybe right before it hits the bottom, like right now. Right there, okay. Now this one might be a little bit complicated. Nope, I think we got it. I think, yep, we got it. Perfect. Nope. Also, nope, but in a different way. Too late. I think I had the right idea there. Just gotta go a little bit early. Yeah, that's it. That's the one. Okay. You can get that 30 coin. Right, right there. Alright. That to come down and then. Nope. Maybe a little bit early, actually. Got it. That was neat. Oh, there's two different options. There were... Boss? Or direct? I don't know what this means. Oh. Oh, well, that's easy. I guess we're trying to take out an enemy. In this case, it's got to be the Wiggler, right? You can do that first. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Got it. All right. Open the door. Oops. Must be an idiot there. Oh no. Huh. That last bit there is gonna be a little bit of a challenge. Hey. Okay. I mean, don't do it like that. Or that. You actually have to get it between them. Ooh, I went a little too early on that last hit there. Yeah. Okay. Oops. Too early. Oh, this is tricky.
I really like this concept, though. It's, this is different. This is different. Go, got it. Open the door. Got some one ups. We'll wait for the uh, shells to finish doing whatever it is they're doing. And, and now we're gonna get pushed through. Got 30 coin. Got 50. 50 coin? I was... I'm just... <laughs> well... <laughs> Still got to take the ride, I guess. That was cool. That was great. Thanks for that one, Ma uh, Natty. <laughs> And he makes some fantastic levels. Seriously. Alright, ML64. I, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. I'm afraid I would butcher that if I said it. Reach a goal in a clown car. We have to be inside the clown car. Oh boy. He's, we, got, we got bloopers. Alright. Well, it's clear to see why this is a shooter level, right? Pretty obvious. It's, it's just like, um... Frickin', um... What's his name's favorite color? Uh, pretty obvious. You know, the one professor from Harry Potter that is full of himself. His favorite color. It's pretty obvious. Anyway. <laughs> Bad thing is, I know, I, I don't know why I'm forgetting his name. <laughs> anyway. From the second book. Anyway. We made it. Pretty interesting stuff. Lockhart, that's it. <laughs> it came to me like, why am I not thinking of this? I, I've read the book twice. I've seen the movie I don't know how many times. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> it's like, why am I not remembering his name? All right, next we have Ezekiel 37-4. By that doctor man. We in for a religious experience here? I don't know. Anyway, let's get the mushroom. Boomerang. That might explain how this is a shooter. Taking out dry bones. So the boomerang, when used on a dry bones, actually kills him. It kills him, kills him. Well, I guess we'll go up this way. Okay. I guess we'll go down this way. <laughs> well, that was a dumb way to die. Press has been established. If there's a dumb way to die, I will find it. I screamed like that. That was different. Nope. Anyway. Let's just slide. There we go. Much better. 
Maybe you think you can do a better job of making a level than what you've seen here in the video. So far, we've seen, we've seen some pretty good ones here. You know how you could really prove your level design skills? By submitting a level for the level design contest going on on the channel right now, there are prizes, and uh, you might be able to win one of them. There's Nintendo eShop codes. There's five different categories. There's gonna be six different levels that take home prizes. And you can submit up to three of them, so maybe you could win half the prizes if you were really awesome. It's possible. Probably not gonna happen, because we've already seen some pretty good ones. But, you know, hey. You might be able to make some better ones. We've reached the top of the flagpole in the end of the level. We are moving on. It's actually pretty cool. Uh, next we have Super Mario Minigames by True Man 6. Start! Dennis! I can kind of see how a tennis minigame might fit the, uh... Might fit the criteria for, uh... A shooter. I can see that, maybe. You are trying to hit something with an, a projectile again, so, you know... I suppose that counts. Well, one of these days, at least I haven't, you know, taken a hit yet. There we go. All right. Oh, would you look at that? We finally got one on the first try. Without any hits. Thus. Perfectly, finally. Alright, spot the difference. This one's easy. It's the fire flower right here. That one was immediate. Like, yeah, that's the answer. Okay. Next, we have see, there's some claws. We got some coins. We got some one way gates. We got some. Oh, it's the um, spring. That's the answer. Okay. We got it. Puzzle! Is that a puzzle, though? Or is it what I like to refer to it as a jump maze? 50 coin. We got some more 50 coin coins. Open the door. What did that say? Oh. Archery. Well, that makes a lot of sense for a shooter level because, well, we are actually shooting things now. Well, and I think you can actually hit the uh, on off block just on its own without even. Doing the whole thing that you're supposed to do here. Uh, we, we he did that anyway. Okay. Come on, we can hit this. One of the next days we. There we go. Open the door. Ow. Run. Oh. I love the Ark of the Coins. We are speedrunning. And 30-50, okay. In love, okay. All right. 
Moving on. Next we have a couple levels we've already played. <laughs> so we're gonna skip over those. Then we have ML51. And that same person whose name I'm afraid to say because I don't know that I could say it right. Nizerbidi, maybe? I, I'm sure I said that wrong. And I apologize. I have no idea how to pronounce that for real. Alright, into the pipe. We have a boomerang suit. I guess counts as our projectile for this level. That lava is still rising. Okay. Maybe we shouldn't have grabbed all of the boomerang suits. They don't just run past them. Don't need to fight them, do we? That's a bully. That's also a bully. And we have a pipe. Oh, we act. Oh. We have to defeat Meowser. Okay. I understand. Ouch. Uh, there's a problem. I am locked. I am soft locked. I can't take on the answer now. I can't drop him in the... And you can't, like, just drop Meowser in the lava. For some reason, Meowser totally, totally, uh, I'm dead. <laughs> Meowser is totally immune to lava. Don't know. I'm dead. Don't know why Meowser is totally <laughs> immune to lava. Why am I dead? <laughs> What am I doing? <laughs> there. Okay. You know what? We're gonna leave that one in its box. I know what it is. Just in case. It'll be there. Alright, don't grab any of these. We're gonna need them. Far, so good. I think we might have this. Not putting up too much of a fight, is he? Just keeps jumping in the lava because it's safe down there. Got him! Alright, we're gonna actually just backtrack this way. Because I don't wanna deal with those bullies. Uh, they're not really dangerous, but... I know this path is safe. And the end level's right over here. Oh, we made it. Once again, I understand projectile the boomerang, I get why it's a shooter. Okay. That seems to be literally the only thing that seems to matter in deciding whether or not it is a shooter level. I know the maker kind of does have the ability to say that. They can put incorrect tags in the level if they want. Alright, this looks promising. Grab all the one-ups. We'll go inside this castle-looking thing. All right, now we have a helmet. Let's get rid of the get rid of those munchers. Oh. 
spawn. Free trap. But we already have the key. We just open the door. It's a game. Okay. Okay, we got the key. Open the door. Oh, we gotta use the pipe to reset this one, because I did it wrong. Nope. <laughs> okay, this one's gonna be... This is different. I've never thought of a level using munchers as a projectile before. But this is what this level's doing. And I find it really interesting. might be unable to finish this. <laughs> okay. I've got to figure out some sort of strategy. This is tricky. I think what we need to do is have... Have it go totally up and over and then land on that. What do I do here? Yes! That's it! <laughs> Open the door. Okay. We needed that to be up so we could throw the, uh, muncher past the thing. Yeah, we got it. Okay, so let me look at this one before I just start going for it. There's a bomb bomb Over on the side. <laughs> you know what, let's just go for it see what happens. If we take this one out, we'll blow that up. Let the bomb walk off. Then if we you know, hit it like right there, we got it. Didn't even have to use all three munchers. Alright. Now there's a lowly little Goomba off on the side. We need to throw that up there and then try that again. Oh, we got him. We got him. We're gonna open the door. That was easy. Last time. This is a really awesome concept. <laughs> this is actually fantastic. All right. I think what may maybe we need to do is that. Okay, maybe we need one that go up a little bit. Okay. Oh, we got it. All right. Cool. That was awesome. That was different. I never would have thought about it. A level that uses munchers as projectiles before. Really cool. All right, moving on. We'll do one more. Next we have... Womp Rush. Let's see how this one... Okay. Guess we need to like jump across this. That so we don't jump straight into a wall and then die. All straight through here into the pipe. Right, gotta run. Being chased by Thwomp. Nothing too out of the ordinary about that. Oh boy. Almost didn't jump there. <laughs>
Oh! We gotta actually beat all the swaps. Okay. Gotta start over. <laughs> so first I messed off. I uh, messed off. I messed up on one of the swaps. This one, I don't see how this is a shooter. <laughs> this one, uh, this is the first one of all these levels that I'm like, alright, I don't get how this is a shooter. And it's the last level we're playing today. I see the concept behind it, but I don't get how the concept is a shooter. See, this is the one I messed up on. Let it die. One down. Go. On this one, we have to wait before we go in the pipe, because I think I messed up on it as well. There we go. There we go. And look. Pretty easy. You know what? Thanks, everybody, for watching. Get those level codes in for the level design contest and be here this Sunday for the IAF World Championship match between the winner of the first ever IAF tournament, Kirby, and the winner of the second IAF tournament, Sonic, as they face off against each other. I'm literally holding the two amiibo for, for them in my, in my hands right now. I don't know why, but I'm like, I'm talking about it. I've got to reach over and grab it. Now you can't see what I'm doing because I don't have my camera on, but I'm literally holding the, the Kirby and Sonic amiibos, and they're going to gonna face off. going to go one-on-one -on -one to determine who will be the first ever IAF World Champion. Be here on Sunday for that. Thank you all for watching. I will see you guys next time, but of course, remember to turn on the light and open the door because you can't have sanity without at least... Yeah, I will see you guys